The best way to stick to a habit is to feel like you're making progress. In this short video, I want to share with you how we can measure the progress of our goal so that we can continue to stick to a habit daily and not give up on it easily. My name is Joanna, your Mindful Mastery Coach, and I am passionate about helping people gain mastery over their mind and emotions so that they can fully enjoy their life. A big issue with trying to maintain a habit is that we may not feel like we're making progress on a daily basis. Some behaviors may take time to show any sort of progress. For example, if you go to the gym, you may not see progress for a month or so. And that's a long time when it's a new habit and something that you're not quite sure is really worth it. So how can we make ourselves feel like we are making some kind of progress? The best way to do this is using habit trackers. A habit tracker can be as simple as crossing off days on a calendar or writing down what you did that day. Tracking our habits will allow us to feel that we are making those small little progresses and it makes us feel like it is worthwhile to continue this behavior, this practice. For example, when you go to the gym, you may not feel like you're making progress because you don't see those abs or you don't see those muscles growing quite yet. But you can record progress in the amount of weight you are using for an exercise or the amount of repetitions you can do of a certain exercise. Maybe last week you could only do five or six and this week you can do eight. Those little progresses, even one more than last week, is a progress. It is showing that you are improving and doing better. And wherever it is possible, try to automate the measurement of your progress. And you can do this by habit stacking your habit with the tracking of that habit. So for example, you go to the gym and right after you do, you write down what you did. Or if you're trying to eat healthier, after a meal, write down what you ate. Linking habits with tracking of those habits will allow you to have that small sense of progress. And the most important thing is to remember that you will have interruptions. You will have things that come up that don't allow you to stick to that habit for that day. So it is vital to remember the rule that you never miss twice. Yes, you may have missed it yesterday, but today you will do it. If you miss just one day, it's okay. Just try to get back to it as quickly as possible. The never miss twice rule is essential because a loss will hurt you far more than any successful day will help you. This is why even if you're having a bad day, even if you don't feel that great, do at least a little bit. Anything is better than nothing. Let's say you wanted to go to the gym and do 20 push-ups and a bunch of sit-ups and you just don't feel like it, you don't feel good, you feel really tired. What if you just do one? What if you just do a couple? Anything is better than zero. Because when you're doing something, you're keeping to the habit. You're reinforcing that habit. It's okay to have a bad day. It's okay to have a day where you don't do that great. But the point is that you are continuing that habit. You are not letting things eat into your progress and take away from what you've been doing all this time. So just to quickly recap, I want to encourage you to make sure you have your habit trackers in place. 
whether it's something that tracks the number of steps you take in a day, or it's some journal where you write down the little progresses you make each day. Make sure that you have those in place because those things are what will keep you encouraged to keep at it, to continue to repeat these habits that you've been forming until you can reach your ultimate goal. So comment down below and let me know where you're tuning in from. Let me know what's one habit tracker that you use in your life. If you like this video, found it helpful or valuable in any way, hit that thumbs up button. And if you're new to this channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the bell notification icon to get notified every time I upload a new video. Because this year, I am committed to helping you gain mastery over your mind and emotions. See you in the next video. Bye!